What is good, BitRushers? It's Kyler. Today we're going to be going over how to set up your config file on the NanoMiner for Ethereum. I'm going to break this up into two parts. The first part is going to be strictly for Ethereum, and the second part is going to be if you want to dual mine Ethereum and Monero. Um, if you're looking to mine Pascal, Ethereum Classic, Zcash, Raven, or Grin, uh, process is going to be pretty similar and you should be able to figure it out watching this video as well. Um, however, I may make a video in the future on these coins. Alright guys, let's get into the video. You should already have NanoMiner installed. If you don't know how to set up and install NanoMiner, I have another video, um, which is actually where I'm getting most of the questions about this on. But if you haven't seen that, go ahead and watch that. Um, we'll get to this point where you have everything installed, and we're just going to go over the config file. Okay, so you're going to open up your config file, and you're going to see that this is what my finished config file looks like with everything set up. It's currently set up to dual mine both Ethereum, which is the ETH hash, and Monero, which is random X, and Monero dual mines on your CPU. So if you don't have a good CPU, you're not going to want to add any of this. Like I said, um, we're going to do two parts to this video. So first thing I'm going to do is just save as, and I am going to save it as number two. So config two, save, um, close it down, open back up the regular config file, and I'm just going to clear it out. So everything below here you can go ahead and clear out, and if you want you can actually clear out the entire, entire file. So I'm actually going to open my other one just for reference here. Um, so once you have your entire file cleared out, you're just going to need two things. The first thing you're going to need to mine Ethereum is coin equals, and this is going to be ETH. That's it. Coin equals ETH. You can do this in uppercase, lowercase, it really doesn't matter. The only other thing that you need is your wallet. So wallet equals, and this is why I actually opened my other one up because I don't remember my wallet address. I'm just going to copy that. So paste your Ethereum wallet in there and file save. This is literally all you need to mine. You need the coin, you're setting it as Ethereum, and you need your wallet address. That's it, guys. Okay, so just to show you that, I'm going to close that down. I'm going to now open up NanoMiner. Okay, so NanoMiner started, and the currency is Ethereum. My wallet is correct. It automatically gives it a rig name, so you don't need that. Set it as Grumpy15C19. 15a and email it says was not set doesn't matter guys okay and look everything it won't let me go down slowly but you can see everything's working here and i'm just gonna wait until i get a share all right well this is uh mining let's just go over a couple other um features within that while we wait and we'll come back and i'll show you that so the next thing that you're gonna maybe want to set up is going to be your rig name and let's see where is that let's open up our config again so if you want that's simply um, going to be the same thing you're going to just name it so type in rig name equals and you can name it anything I typically call this shovel one and so rig name equals shovel one let me just do a shovel one like that um, and the final piece here, and this is the one that really kind of confuses everyone, is the email address. You do not need it for anything other than to set your minimum payment um, as far as a password goes. So your email is also used as your password. Um, you don't need to like encrypt it or keep it secret or use anything you know like that because literally the only thing you can do with this password is to change your payout rate um, to make it you know quicker or um, slower. You know, so the less amount of Ethereum in your wallet before you get paid out, or the more Ethereum in your wallet to get paid out. You can't change anything. You can't change, put it to a different address or anything like that with the password. So um, you you literally um, can put anything for that. I, I typically put password, and so what you've seen in mine is email equals. 
password and I literally just type password as my password okay guys and so if you want to go in there and, and hack my account and change out my payout rate go ahead um, I don't keep much coin in there anyway because um, I actually uh, don't use nano miner um, as my main mining software so um, the other th reason you would maybe want your email address is if you actually want to monitor this you're going to want to put your email in there and it's going to send you about a thousand emails an hour um, so I wouldn't recommend using your normal e email address maybe you have a spam account um, that you use but you could if you're at work or you're away and you want to monitor and make sure it's up and it's actually mining um, then you would want to put in a real email address and actually get updates personally I'm usually near my computer um, and I don't feel like getting a thousand emails so I don't use a real email address which is why I use password um, that is basically it guys you can also configure your pool if you want to set um, which pool is your main pool or which one are in order of preferences but that's totally optional and to come back up here to the top you can see that um, I am currently in the West Coast one it automatically assigns them so if you just do you know if you don't set them um, it, it'll, it'll just automatically arrange them but these are the pools right here on the screen and you can find those on the nano uh, pool.org website as well okay so if you're looking to dual mine um, on your CPU Monero you're basically gonna copy over the exact same thing you have here down um, except instead of coin you're gonna do in parentheses random X um, just how I have it here um, the square carrot or the square parentheses here brackets you're gonna put random X uh, there and it's gonna tell it that this next coin is um, Monero uh, that's the the miner that it uses and so you're gonna then have your wallet for Monero you're gonna again put a rig name and a password for email if you want to add those so after you have added those just hit file save and you should be good to go let's go ahead and test it out let's file nano miner back up and here we go it seems like the ethereum is back in and working and yep right below it there it's going too fast so let me uh, show you guys okay here it is so random x and it loads it up currency monero wallet uh, rig name email and password and it automatically assigns the pools again so you guys don't have to worry about that i recommend not worrying about the pools just go ahead and set your wallet your rig name your email which is your password and also you have to make sure you set your coin and your coin is set up right for what pool you're in and all that um, so again here it is coin equals ETH for Ethereum your wallet wallet equals rig name and email you don't actually need these are optional um, coming down here you need to add random X if you want to dual mine Monero you need to then add your Monero wallet address which is different than your Ethereum wallet address you need to name the rig I recommend it the same thing as you've named above and again optionally you can add an email address or a password that's it guys and you can see um, we're mining we haven't got a share on this one yet but I'm not gonna wait around and show you guys um, it is what it is you guys will get a um, you'll get a share within about five minutes hopefully depending on your uh, hash rate and once you have a share and you've waited at least 15 minutes you can then check it on the nano pool website hope this guy would hope this video was helpful for you guys um, if it was go ahead and hit the thumbs up smash that like button subscribe for future videos if you guys like content like this hit the bell for notifications to be notified when my new videos are released and I also now have a telegram group which will be linked below I have a Twitter account follow me at bitrush9000 also be linked below and you can um, join my ethereum giveaway at 500 subs if you want to join that just go ahead and leave your ethereum wallet address in the comments below and make sure you're sub to the channel thanks again for watching guys I'll see you in the next one